for any Xbox or PlayStation codes or anything gaming related, check out G2A.com. And if you need any Ultimate Team coins, then head over to UFIFA. The code CHEZ will get you a discount on both sites and all links are down below. Hey guys, how's it going? Chez back again and welcome to the final vote for the new career mode. You guys voted yesterday, just over 2,000 of you, and the highest vote was for a different Barclays Premier League side. Now before we get into this one, just a quick note, I am fully aware of those of you that uh, were more keen on having a series that was outside of the Barclays Premier League, considering we've already done Chelsea and the amount of BPL series on, uh, on YouTube already with BPL sides. So bearing that in mind, the next series after this one will definitely be abroad and not from the Barclays Premier League so I'll we'll probably choose sides from the Bundesliga or Serie A considering that, that neither of those are leagues we've covered yet in FIFA 15 that'll be the series after this one so uh, at the minute we're voting for Barclays Premier League so there will be again a link in the description to a straw poll but again I urge you to watch the video first before voting and this vote will actually be open a little bit longer than the previous one so you'll have uh, until uh, Saturday night at the very least to vote on this one before I uh, you know I start recording on Sunday to get the video first episode out on Monday and again just a quick word to those of you that were asking for uh, a series in smaller leagues like the Eredivisie or the MLS etc like I mentioned in the previous video although I did mention it towards the end so you may not have seen it um, I am planning on starting to stream on Twitch in the new year when we move house and I get my uh, fibre optic broadband etc so I can start to stream and I will do a series or not necessarily a series but I will stream career mode with a smaller league like that so that you guys uh, you know if you're about can uh, can enjoy smaller leagues etc as well but for YouTube I, I tend to do uh, bigger sides or bigger leagues etc the ones that are more popular so uh, you know I get the balance of you guys enjoy career mode series and also because it's uh, something that might be searched a little bit more or there are more people that are interested in a certain league or larger team then you know it helps the channel grow as well I have to balance uh, you know those two things out the growth of the channel and what you guys like to see so uh, you know, I, I do bear that in mind for me, please. I do apologise, though, if uh, I am doing something that you don't necessarily want to watch. But, of course, you are more than welcome to stick around and uh, watch us go through it again. Like we say, we're going to be doing a Barclays Premier League team this time around. So, uh, I've actually got six teams that are going to be in the vote. Three are larger sides that you'd say probably uh, top eight, perhaps, question mark. And uh, the, others are, the other three are mid-table sides, the first of which is Aston Villa. So Aston Villa will be the top vote in the poll. If you want to vote for them, then feel free to do so. A team mixed with uh, experience and uh, and fresh young talent. Not the biggest of budgets, but I will use the 60% plus uh, you know transfer budget if I use one of the three mid-table sides if uh, you know their budgets aren't necessarily adequate for what we might like to do. So Aston Villa is the first option. The second option, as we scroll through, will be Everton. They're one of the top eight sides, one of the bigger sides that will be on the vote. Everton, £12 million is their transfer budget. I probably would use the 60% uh, the bonus on them as well, considering there is uh, a pretty average budget for a side like Everton, although they have been run on a shoestring budget, shoestring budget for years now. But with Roberto Martinez in charge, they have spent a little bit more, so perhaps it might be a little bit more realistic if uh, I did spend a little bit more money if you choose Everton so that'll be the second vote the next one will be Liverpool obviously a uh, huge budget already so we wouldn't need the 60% bonus if you do select Liverpool obviously they have a half decent squad already although really struggling in real life this year knocked out of the Champions League struggling in the Premier League and they really need some revitalization so perhaps you would like me to see me do that for them they are the third team on the vote the next one as we scroll through is Newcastle one of the other mid-table sides again only 14 and a half million pounds to the budget so I might be tempted to use the 60% plus boost for them. They were on a previous vote as well and uh, didn't win but uh, they're obviously back again here. A few good players in there of course the likes of uh, Musa Sissoko and uh, most notably Remy Kabea who isn't in that starting lineup actually. He's an extremely exciting talent so he would probably be one of my main starters if you choose Newcastle. Scrolling through that's four now isn't it? Scrolling through the next one is QPR. Uh, another mid-table perhaps even relegation threatened side who uh, only have a small budget so again I'd probably use the 60% uh, boost and it would be a case of taking QPR from a side that kind of yo-yoed in recent years and taking them up towards the high reaches of the Premier League and maybe even Europe as well. Kind of like Cal Frizi did a couple of years ago back on FIFA 13. That really helped his channel. Perhaps if you choose QPR that could really help my channel. Who knows? But uh, the sixth and final side is going to be Spurs um, another side that have a decent budget of 22 million pounds so I won't be using the 60% extra bonus with Spurs if you decide 
that uh, Spurs is the side that you would like to see me do. Obviously, got a lot of strength at the minute in their starting lineup. A few youngsters coming through as well that we could perhaps bleed into the first team, like Eric Dyer, uh, Danny Rose, and uh, Ryan Mason, etc. So perhaps if you do select Spurs, they would be a decent series for you to watch. Who knows? But that is going to be uh, everyone, I think. Yes. So uh, we've got as the three bigger sides: Spurs, Liverpool, and Everton. And then there's the three mid-table slash smaller sides, Newcastle, uh, Aston Villa and QPR. The vote will start as of now. You're seeing this video on 1pm Friday afternoon and will run until around about, well, I don't know, probably at least tomorrow evening, uh, maybe even up until like midnight. So just so I've got enough time to, uh, you know, get a thumbnail made uh, from a friend, Joe, and, uh, you know... Uh, you know, record ahead, uh, most notably, to uh, to at least get the first episode recorded for Monday. So yes, that's going to bring today's little episode to a close or final vote. This is going to be the final vote, and uh, the new series will start on Monday. Whichever team wins this vote will be the one that starts on Monday. And again, apologies to those of you that would have preferred a series abroad. Like I say, I promise the next series after this one will be outside of the Barclays Premier League and outside of the English Leagues because of course we've got the uh, road to glory in the English Leagues with Cambridge United as well an episode of which will come to you t tonight and of course tomorrow night and Sunday night as well if you don't know what and when I upload there is a schedule in the description of every single video so you can check that out I do upload two videos every single day without fail regardless of YouTube issues regardless of uh, me going away etc I do try and make sure that I record and have record ahead and have two videos recorded for you every single day I've done that for about 10 months now without fail so hopefully that continues to go well the channel will continue to go well and you guys will enjoy the new series whichever team it is that you vote for but that will bring this vote to a close thank you very much for well, this video to a close the vote is still open as i record this or as you see this unless you're watching it after oh, never mind the vote's open from now until saturday night and uh, hopefully you guys will uh, enjoy one of the teams that we select but that's all for now thank you very much for watching guys and i'll see you next time